So we are about to go sledding and we're going out with one of the dog sledding companies here. Yeah, really interested to see how it all works and where we go and what we do, what we see. I know Cara is planning on doing a 360 film. We should be down there in about, well, 15 minutes, so it should be fun. <laughs> How far have we got to go, guys? Uh, where are your dogs kept? Uh, 10 kilometers in, uh, out in uh, the Advent Valley. Okay. Where we uh, keep the dogs so we can stay uh, good friends with our neighbors. Now they are uh, pretty excited. They know what's coming. I think it's going to be pretty noisy when we open this door. Here I've uh, put up our teams for today. So when we're gonna get the dogs, you will come up here and me or one of the other guides will give you the right size harness for your dog and point you in the direction of where the dog lives. And who have I got this time? This is John. John? He lives right here. John, come. The red ones are females and are on that side of the dog yard and the blue ones are male and they are on, live on this side of the dog yard. They're trying to kiss each other. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yeah, I got here. Okay. Come on. No, 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 no. Look in the camera. When we start out from the dog yard, you will have put your dogs in the team. And when the last dog is put in, you stay with two feet on the brake and hold on. This is because uh, the dogs get uh, full of adrenaline and very eager when they uh, realize they're going out for a run. And they might jump and they pull the, the ropes. And then I can't guarantee that this anchor will hold them. Because the uh, five dogs, when they want to go, they are very strong. So the huskies have this amazing ability to uh, regulate themselves using their paws. So they have like an active control of their temperature with their paws. Bears do it too. So out here, you know, they, these guys survive comfortably in minus 40. Even at minus 10 today, they are warm. So they lose their heat and control their temperature using thermoregulation in their pores. It's pretty amazing stuff. Look at, look at these guys. They're so hot, they're so warm. They just have to get rolling around in the snow. And we're off. No, you don't steer anything. They know where they're going. They know where they're going. Why on earth would you do it on skis when you get dogs to pull you around? My face is tingling because of the coldness. But it's... You kind of forget about it. The one thing you can't forget about is the smell of dog bum hole, which is pretty punchy. That is my only main concern with all this, is I get a mouthful of dog. Of dog. Yeah. Come on, get us over. Please, welcome home. Oh, it's fantastic. It was absolutely fantastic. I don't know how on earth I'm gonna get out of here with any grace or decor. You can't really leave here without saying goodbye to the tiny little ones. So these guys are future. <coughs> yeah, your future little huskies, aren't you? Look at your future little sledders. Hey, mum. <coughs> they will want to run out, so you can go inside now. You go, I'll go in, I'll go in. It's a puppy park. So of course, there is very little nice. cuter up here than husky puppies. Oh, look at you. 
look at you with your little fat belly. Nice jobs go. This one is one of the better ones. Yes, yes you are.